Hi, in this video, I'm going to tell you about one of the space phenomena, and it's very interesting, a black hole. I'm Carissa from Third Science Program, and this is What is Black Hole? Start off with what are we going to talk about? Uh, first one is what is a black hole? And second is how big are black holes? And third is if black holes are black, how do scientists know that they are there? Or one is how do black holes form? And the last one is could a black hole destroy Earth? So what exactly is a black hole? A black hole is a place in space where gravity pulls so much that even light cannot get out. The gravity is so strong because matter has been squeezed into a tiny space. This can happen when a star is dying. Now, can you really see a black hole? Because no light can get out, people cannot see a black hole. They are invisible. But space telescopes with special tools can help find a black hole. The special tools can see how stars that are very close to a black hole act differently than other stars. So if a black holes are black, how do scientists know that they are there? A black hole cannot be seen because strong gravity pulls all of the light into the middle of a black hole. But scientists can see how the strong gravity affects the stars and gas around a black hole. Scientists can study stars to find out if they are flying around or orbiting a black hole. When a black hole and a star are close together, high energy light is made. This kind of light cannot be seen with human eyes. So scientists use satellites and telescopes in space to see the high energy light. Now the question is how big are black holes? Black holes can be big or small. Scientists think the smallest black holes are as small as just one. These black holes are very tiny but have the mass of a large mountain. Mass is the amount of matter or stuff in an object. Another kind of black hole is called stellar. Its mass can be up to 20 times more than the mass of the sun. There may be many, many stellar mass black holes in Earth's galaxy. Uh, and Earth's galaxy is called the Now, the largest black holes are called supermassive. These black holes have masses that are more than 1 million suns together. Scientists have found proof that every large galaxy contains a supermassive black hole at its center. The supermassive black hole at the center of the Milky Way galaxy is called Sagittarius A. It has a mass equal to about 4 million suns and would fit inside a large ball that can hold a few million Earths. So, how does the black hole form? All stars start to fusing hydrogen into helium. Small and cool stars will stop soon after that and will not continue to fuse another heavier element. The very hot and more massive stars continue to fuse in process to create more massive elements, not only burning hydrogen and helium, but also carbon, oxygen, and silicon. As the star reaches the end of its life, the nuclear fusion forms iron. Iron is a very stable element and does not easily fuse to heavier elements. Therefore, it requires much more energy to fuse than it can produce. Now, therefore, the iron core doesn't fuse into further elements and the star stops producing energy. When the energy production stops, the force of the gravity can finally overcome the outward push from the energy generated from the fusion. As a result, the heavy outer layers of a gas of the star are unsupported and the star's core collapses and in the resulting of implosion, blowing apart the rest of the star. Don't start a conversation. The explosion of the star is called supernova. All massive stars will end up this way at the end of their lives, but only the most massive of them will form a black hole. So from all of the information that we just read, could a black hole destroy the Earth? Now, fortunately, Black holes do not go around in space eating stars, moons, and planets. Earth will not fall into black hole because no black hole is close enough to the solar system for Earth to do that. Even if a black hole of the same mass as the sun were to take the place of the sun, Earth still wouldn't fall in. Earth and the other planets would orbit the black hole as they orbit the sun. 
just like what happened right now. The sun will never turn into a black hole. The sun is not a big enough star to make a black hole. Using the Event Horizon Telescope, scientists obtained a black hole at the center of galaxy M87, outlined by a mission from hot gas swirling around it under the influence of strong gravity near its event horizon. So that's all from me. Thank you for watching.